365.tv where I am reading one personal development book every day over the next year and bringing to you a quick review on the book or a lesson that I learned. The book I read today is Ogmandino's The Greatest Mystery in the World. And again, uh, if you guys have watched any of these videos, you know I'm a huge Ogmandino fan. Uh, he writes in a story format with a lesson to tell. And this is the story of, her, of his friend, uh, Simon, coming back and reuniting with him and teaching him some more lessons and just the conversations they have. And, and I wanted to kind of just expand, instead of me just explaining the entire book to you so you don't have to actually go out and read it, because uh, some of these books tell a story that I want you guys to actually enjoy without knowing the whole plot. So I thought I'd just pick something out of the book, and what I wanted to pick out was something that they underlined in here, and it says, it is a sorry day for those who cannot see opportunities where they are, but think they can do better somewhere else. And so listen, you know, really reflect on that. What does that mean? Well, wherever you are in your life, in your business, chances are you can have success there. If it's really, really where you want to be. First of all, I think it's so important that people have passion in what they do. If you don't love what you do, find something that you do love and find a way to make it work. And I think that statement rings so true. I think so many times we always are, are chasing the next best thing. And especially in network marketing, if you're a network marketer like I am, you don't want to be you know, getting involved in one company and then you don't have massive success and, and so you go out and you try to find another company. Listen, if, if there's people in your business that are making money, uh, then it's not the company's fault, it's not the product, it's not the compensation plan, it's you. And that's why I'm a big fan of really becoming a student of network marketing and planting my feet in one company and making it happen in that one company. And I really suggest you guys do the same. So, you know, people, you know, will, will really look to you and what you're doing and your team needs to see that, you know what, they see that you're going to the top in your company. They're not going to, they're not going to want to follow someone that's not going to stick around a long time. So remember that when you're building your team, when you're out there prospecting, when you're recruiting, when you're training new team members, uh, your team will do what you do. And if you want them to follow you to the top, then you need to let them know that you're heading to the top. So don't always be looking for greener pastures. Uh, if there's money to be made in your company, if people are already making it, then you can do the same thing. So the book was The Greatest Mystery in the World. That was just one of the lessons I took out of it. And hopefully that was helpful for you guys. So uh, pick up one of Og's books. Uh, any of them are great. They'll, they'll make you want to turn the page and keep reading until you finish. So I uh, hope you guys have a fantastic day, and we'll talk to you soon. Thank you.